how are you? <laughs> Good. I so she's a 27 year old uh, history of an abnormal pop of ASCUS HPV positive. And um, this was her first abnormal pap smear. This is her first colposcopy. She is currently on depo for birth control and um, is going to receive the Gardasil vaccine, has not been vaccinated yet, no history of tobacco use. And we are discuss the procedure and we're gonna start here. Okay. So first, I'm just gonna wipe off your cervix with a Q-tip, okay? okay. So you just let me know how everything is going, if something's too much or you need a break or anything, okay? So we're just, I'm just looking at your cervix right now, normal, and taking some picture, okay? The next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna apply a solution to your cervix to look and see if any area looks abnormal. So this is the acetic acid solution. Okay, I'm just gonna wipe one more little area off here. What does she look like under the green filter? Not bad. I'm gonna just snap a picture here. Katie, you might wanna take a little uh, brush and maybe just do a little gentle twirl, see if you can get that out of the end of the cervix. Her end of cervix is very, uh, she has a small SCG. Yeah. Visible. So I'm just going to touch here. Oh, okay. There we go. Oh, almost. <laughs> it just keeps falling back. You just have a little piece of mucus I'm trying to move and it wants to stay That's right actually, there. I can actually see a little bit better now. That's a little can bit better get, though. Can we get a little closer? There we go. That's fine. Nice. Yeah. All right. Well, it doesn't look bad. No. Um, what are your thoughts? So I'm thinking, I can show you on here, but I'm thinking, you know, maybe over here on the three o'clock, this pop spot obviously is just mucus here at the nine. Um, yeah. Let's see if I can pull that. And then, um, we can biopsy actually. So everything looks pretty good, but we will. Um, that looks better that I moved it down at least. Um, yeah, there's that little <laughs> spot kind of coming in at nine o'clock now. I mean, it, yeah. it, all, it all looks pretty low grade. Maybe a little, um, a little CIN one, kind of like that little geographic border at six o'clock. But there's just not much there, which is good. Uh -uh. Yeah. That didn't do a whole lot. So for sure, I'm going to do three. Um, that nine o'clock area kind of lit up a bit. So. Yeah. Yeah, I would do like around three and nine. I'm just going to wipe you off again on here. And then maybe like a little ECC. Yeah, I agree. You're doing okay? Okay. So now we're going to do the biopsies, that little cramping and pinching I was talking about. And then we'll be out of here, okay? So three and nine. You got that? And yeah. ECG. Yeah. Grab a and picture then. of that, Katie. Perfect. And go back to your old picture with the acetyl whitening. And um, do an X on where you feel like you're going to biopsy that. Yep, right in and there. And then this is going to be like, in here without the mucus you can see a little bit more but i'm gonna probably exactly exactly here. yeah i would pull up a little bit more to nine yeah okay. and then out maybe a tiny bit yeah biopsy. you're doing great all right my dear so we're gonna do those biopsies i was talking about okay so you'll just feel a little pinch and then cramp so three first okay Pinch again. Perfect, Katie. Good job. Yeah. Okay. Her, her cervix was very helpful. Now I'm just going to put that ointment on I was talking about. You're doing great. And she might need a little four by four. Yeah. Four by four pressure. 
I'm going to just push this in a little bit just to hold pressure on your cervix, but we are finished with everything. Looks great, Katie. Any questions? No, I think we are good. Thank you. All right. Okay. Okay, bye-bye.